Tonight I'm cooking fillets and homegrown Brussels sprouts on the big green egg. Let's get it. Also bought a few new tools, this awesome tripod that's gonna allow me to get some overhead shots. I brought an umbrella to block the sun. Then I also had two companies send me stuff. This is a Smithy 12 inch cast iron skillet and grill grates. Still waiting on everything to come up to temp, but we're gonna go ahead and get the Brussels sprouts started. I'm gonna start with a scoop of bacon up. And then these are homegrown Brussels sprouts. First time I've ever grown my own. We're gonna get those in there, get them mixed around and coated with that bacon up. We're gonna add some pepper, salt, some garlic powder, and some onion powder. Get those all nice and mixed up. And now I'm just gonna flip all the flat sides down. You can see the Brussels are starting to get some color on them, just how I like them, a little char on that flat side. Now I'm gonna add the steaks on the grill grate to try to get those perfect lines. I have my meter in that one so I can monitor the temperatures and I'm going to put this weight on them. The Brussels are almost done. I'm going to add a balsamic glaze to them and toss them around in it. Once the Brussels are completely coated, you can take them off. Now we can slide this over to the middle. I'm going to lift this off and scoop them for a turn. We're going two minutes, then turn, two minutes, then flip. Now we'll just flip them over one more time and let them cook until they're at the desired temperature. We're at 128, time to take them off. The steaks have had time to rest. I'm gonna cut into this first one here. You can see it's nice and pink in the middle, super tender. Look at that give. Now it's time for that first bite. Looks incredible. You just can't beat a filet. Let's eat y'all. If you enjoyed this video, you're gonna love the rest and you can get started by clicking that one at the top of the screen. I would also be honored if you would subscribe to my channel by clicking the button at the bottom.